I don't know if everybody understands it, but AI is everywhere. We Google search something, we navigate our maps, everything has some sort of AI behind it. The minor AI is an important step if you want to go into that direction. Programming was something that I uh, wanted to do for a long time, but I didn't feel secure enough to try it on my own. So that's why I ne needed a little push and the minor was perfectly suited for that. I followed a programming course in my uh, bachelor. So then I got interested and I got a notification on Canvas that showed me uh, about this new uh, AI minor. We teach uh, the fundamentals of Python programming, uh, but we also teach students how to think like a computer, uh, which is, covers the algorithmic thinking part. So building algorithms, procedures that do exactly what we want them to do in order to solve computational tasks. The fun part is that you also get to apply uh, the knowledge that you uh, gain. So an example of that is uh, I learned about neural networks, but also got to build a neural network. So that was really fun. You need to program a lot at the minor, and the program is actually learning a language. You need to try it out, look it up, uh, experiment with it. So uh, I would describe the student population as very diverse. It's a, a wide spectrum of people, from uh, people with a, a solid mathematical and programming background to people from a more theoretical background, like law or uh, psychology, who are super excited and uh, enthusiastic about learning how to teach a computer to do things. So in the Mino you have a lot of different levels of students and this can be a little bit challenging for the professor of course but for all the different levels they have a lot of patience to maybe explain it a little bit more or find some extra literature for you to uh, look into. So uh, I'm a communication and information scientist student. I currently don't have a technical background uh, but when following this uh, artificial intelligence minor I realized that I uh, want to go further with an AI so that's why I also want to uh, follow the Artificial Intelligence and Cognitive Science uh, Master. Of course you have also exams. Uh, luckily the prof professors really prepare you uh, well and let you know a great time beforehand what they expect from you. You start with like easy things like uh, really basic knowledge about AI, but uh, afterwards you get more like, into different and more difficult types of uh, concepts. But it's really doable because the teachers are really uh, helping you and providing enough information and support. I don't want to be that person, but you have to put in the hours and the effort. Uh, there is a specific amount of hours assigned to the course, and that's something that I say in the first lecture. So what was a great uh, advantage for me was that the minor wasn't full-time, so therefore I could still do my other courses at my own university. And the fact that the minor is quite hybrid and uh, there are opportunities to go to campus and to talk with everybody, or you can just do it in your own pace. I would say even if you, if you try the minor AI and you don't end up following that track or that career path, uh, still I, I do think that some programming experience or at least some knowledge about how a computer works and how AI works and how machine learning works is valuable for, for the rest of your career, whatever that is.